Hey guys, it's Sam C from the SWOTOR guys, and we're back for another episode of the Warp to 50. I believe this is episode 4, so got a story coming up here. Just says to return to the Republic Command Center, so we're gonna do that. And, uh, okay, I guess we gotta walk over here. Speak to Fuse, apparently, so see what happens here. After this loading screen, of course. For some reason, this place always takes a while to load. Oh, but... Sergeant, hey, you're back. Good job out there in Talaran. Really nice work. I'll take the field box you retrieved, Sergeant. And maybe next time, you could bring me a live Republic agent instead. Man, this guy Lieutenant is Lieutenant Bazarin here still thinks you're mission-worthy, so he has a task for you. He'll brief you while I start decoding Bellis's intel. Oh, yes. Um, we found an urgent lead while you were in Talaran, Sergeant. The perfect op for our new assault specialist. What kind of lead? Uh, well, because it's not so much a lead as it is a bomb threat. Here's what happened. This refugee comes into the fort, right? Not that unusual, but this guy says he knows about a separatist bombing. One happening today. All we got was his name, Miru. Because he was thrown out of the fort before we could get to him. I take it this guy's intel was less than reliable, or else he'd still be here. Bums come here every day trying to trade intel for credits. It's bogus 90% of the time, so the grunts downstairs usually chase them off. I guess Miru could be lying, but what if he does know about the ZR-57? We can't take that risk. Anyway, we looked into it, and Miru is staying over in the refugee camp. See if you can find him there. Yes, sir. And while you're gone, Jorgen will decode the information from Bellis' field box. Hopefully we'll find out what the Separatists are hiding. Now get to the refugee camp and get Miru's intel, soldier. If this bombing's happening soon, there's no time to waste. Okay. Can I use these? Apparently, because I don't have any. How did I get dark side points from that? Uh, I must have done something earlier, maybe? I don't know. Okay, so that's the refugee camp, apparently. It's inside the fort, so uh, that's a good spot for a refugee camp, I suppose. We're gonna go talk to this guy. Apparently, he um, put in a bomb threat, and then they kicked them out of the fort. I mean, yeah, I guess this isn't really part of the fort. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Hopefully he has some uh, reliable information here, so we can find this bomb and get off Ord Mantell. Oh no. no. Oh. Not this again. What, you people didn't have enough fun beating me up at the fort? Uh oh, I'm not to be mean to this guy, aren't I? You're nothing but thugs in uniform, and your bosses are going to hear about it. Your bosses' bosses! All the way on Coruscant, you hear me? You're going down. I'm not just a thug in uniform. I'm a heavily armed thug in uniform. <laughs> yeah, I see that. So, uh, do you want something, or are you just here to threaten me? Where have the Separatists hidden the device? Where are they going to detonate it? So, now you want the information. Well, you know, I probably could have helped a few hours ago, before that whole savage beating I got. But now, after all the trauma, I might have just forgot everything I knew about any Separatist uh -huh. bombings. I bet you'd remember everything, if I just hit you hard enough. <laughs> see? Now that's, oh, that's exactly awesome. the kind of attitude that got you people into this mess. You need to make me feel appreciated. Now, if I knew how much the Republic valued my contribution, say, with a few credits, my memory would probably be much better. <laughs> oh, no. Uh... How about I just start shooting off your fingers, Miro? That sounds fun. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, let's just calm down a minute here, okay? I'll, I'll help. I saw the Separatists hiding Horrible. a bunch of bombs alongside the road near here. You know, setting up an ambush. I heard them say the bombs are time to blow when some troop convoy is going past. I don't know when, but it's got to be soon. So, uh, are we done here? Because I got a lot of work I need to do around the camp today. Thank you for your cooperation, sir. It's greatly appreciated. <laughs> yeah, well, nice. sure. Uh, anytime. I threatened to, like, shoot off his fingers and then I'm all nice to him at the end. I'm quite bipolar so far, my character. Okay, so. All right, Sergeant. Oh. I copied what Miru said, and this bomb situation sounds like the real thing. I want you to head for the road Miru described and locate the Separatist hidden bombs. A troop convoy is scheduled to move through the area any minute now, so you need to get those bombs defused ASAP. Double time it, soldier. Why do I get dark side points? Oh. Ah, oh, jeez. Doing have it. more important objectives to complete. Those are Republic troopers, Sergeant. You will not ignore a threat to the lives of our comrades, regardless of your original mission. 
Now stop arguing and get those bombs defused. Now. You know what? I want to defuse these bombs. I'm just trying to be dark side, okay? So I'm going to go do it. I mean, I don't mind being dark side at points, like certain points. But, uh, when it's like threatening my own, uh, comrades, it's just not cool. Not cool. So, maybe I'll go light side from now on. Just like, in certain situations. Because I don't want to feel forced to do dark side every time. It's not that big of a deal. But, uh, we'll see. Because dark side is definitely fun, but, um, how'd that guy die? He just died. And some other guy like took his place. Okay. And yeah. Love that skill. Like this and like that. Oh, what was I uh I was uh attempting to rap there. And I stopped myself because that would have been quite embarrassing. So I'm glad I stopped myself in time. How much of these bombs do I have to get? Oh, three. It's not a lot. I mean, these are fairly obvious bombs. I don't know how they can't just avoid them, but... Oh well. I guess I'll disarm them. I think we're actually hiring the wrong people if they can't see these bombs. Like, we're in a war zone and they're like not looking out for these obvious things on the road. I just... I don't know. I think we gotta do some... Change our recruiting po process or something like that. Because that's pretty embarrassing. I just got way out of hand there. I just kept talking about it and talking about it and I'm still talking about it. And we're moving on. We are now moving on. Okay, so let's get this third bomb here. I also got to kill two more for that bonus. Shouldn't be a problem because I'll probably have to kill two up here for this third bomb. Uh, where is it? Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. And, oh, they come in out of nowhere, these idiots. So sorry I haven't been putting out too much of these episodes. I, I do want variety. I don't want to just upload this. Also, I would go a bit faster, but uh, I think like two or three a week of these is good for now. And, you know, I'll do other content as well because I don't think everyone just wants to see this. But uh, I think two a week is not overkill or anything like that. So, okay. Now I gotta return that Republic Command Center. I could use my quick travel, but we're, like, right here anyway, so might as well just walk back. Also, I think, uh, Mass Effect 3 beta is starting next week, I'm pretty sure, if you bought Battlefield 3. And I did, so I should be getting beta access, hopefully. I think it starts on the 17th, so I'd like to make a video for that or something. I mean, I know I'm the SWOTOR guys, and, uh, mostly gonna stick to the Star Wars The Old Republic content, but... Might be good to upload that. I mean, it's close enough, I would say. Like, there's some similarities with Mass Effect and uh, Star Wars The Old Republic. It's both Bioware, so... And it's also like, one of my favorite games ever, that trilogy. So, love to upload some. Uh, let me know if you're, like, completely opposed to me uploading that. But, uh, I'll most likely upload it. I will be getting it for the PC. I played the first two on 360, so I'm not going to be able to continue my story... Which kind of sucks, but I want to switch over to PC because I don't know. I like it better than the console. Sergeant, Sergeant, that's just my opinion, me, though. Sergeant, and this guy again. I'm very sorry to bother you, sir, but you're the only person I could think to go to. All of the other officers I've met here are completely corrupt. All but you, sir. I know I can trust you. You know, I think I might go I light side trust, on this one. Now speak freely. What's this all about? It's my CO, Lieutenant Verk. He's scamming everyone in his command, and nobody does anything about it. Verk forces all of us to kick up to him to get safe postings. Credits, weapons, stuff we confiscate from oh, the Oh yeah, sets, this guy deserves everything. To If die. you don't play along, Verk assigns you to the most dangerous patrol <laughs> routes on the better. island. It's like a death sentence. Corrupt officers give us all a bad name. Someone should report this guy. My buddy tried to report him. The next day, he disappeared to Talaran. And the day after that, he came back in a box. You're in Havoc That's Squad, sir. You're important. You could talk to someone who matters. 
I'll inform my superiors I'm gonna get about light side points from that. That's good. I might prior. later though. So. Thank you, sir. So much. I really appreciate this. I do. I just do what I can. I really appreciate it, sir. Thanks again. Okay. Let's go in here and talk to this guy again. Oh, he's back. Welcome back, Sergeant. Good work dealing with that ambush. I'm sure the troopers from 45th Infantry will be singing your praises for some time. Only because they don't know how reluctant the sergeant was to help them. You would have uh -oh. let our fellow soldiers die. It won't happen again, Lieutenant. You have my word. Let's move on, people. We have an important new mission to discuss. Lieutenant Jorgen has finished reviewing the intel from Bellis's field box. It's given us a real breakthrough. Was there more? Or do I start guessing? Bellis discovered that the Separatists have the ZR-57 secured inside their supply outpost on Manna Point, a small island just off the coast. I sent Wraith ahead to reconnoiter the outpost, and she successfully located a secured area where we believe the bomb is stored. Judging by the dramatic increase in the number of guards and the complex security systems installed, we're certain the bomb is there. Honestly, with security like this, Manna Point looks more like an Imperial military base than a Separatist hideout to me. I think the Seps are getting a helping hand, Commander. From the Imperials? That seems unlikely, Lieutenant. Surely our spies would have discovered any Imperial involvement on Ord Mantell long before now. The Seps do seem unusually well equipped, Commander. We can discuss the possibility of any Imperial connections later. Let's focus on the mission at hand. Wraith can't breach the secure area of the Manit Point outpost alone, so I'm sending you in immediately. The Manit Point bridge is out of commission, so you'll have to make an amphibious approach to the island. When you arrive, Affect entry into the supply outpost and rendezvous with Wraith inside. She'll give you further instructions at that time. Understood? Understood, sir. This mission is gravely important, Sergeant. Many lives depend on your success. Dismissed. Hi guys, sorry I skipped ahead a bit there, but I just pretty much walk from here to there. Just to grab these quests and then I'm going to end this episode here. I'll explain why in just a second though, after this cutscene, so. Damn Separatists. All they're doing is cutting themselves off. Cockeyed fools. All of them. Did you hear about the bridge to Manit Point? Those foolish Separatists think that by blowing up the bridge to Manit Point, they're striking a blow for the people. But all they've created is division. And division is death. Lots of good people got stuck in Manit Point when the bridge went out. The Separatists are trying to divide us. Divide and conquer, right? There was a doctor there, Jay and Kett. Brilliant medical man and staunch Republic supporter, essential to our effort. We need someone with the know-how to find him. I'd be happy to volunteer. That's the spirit. Volunteering. I like it. Breeds unity. Like I said, last contact we had with the good doctor, he was on Manit Point. Seeing as the bridge is out, you'll have to swim the channel. And you'll want to watch out for the Separatists on the shore. If you have any luck finding the doctor, Try to get him back here. Think you can handle it? I can handle myself. Great. That's the spirit. You know, I think we've got a chance at winning this thing. Now hurry up to Manit Point. We have a moment to lose. Okay. I'm gonna go grab that other quest that's just right out there. So I'm gonna end it after that, though, just because if I went and did all those quests over there, this episode would end up being, like, 40 minutes long, and I don't think most people wouldn't want to watch that, so, um... And it's also very annoying to render, so we'll end it here. I mean, it's probably about 10 minutes or so, so uh, yes, maybe dear, even longer, so overreacting. should be all right. We don't know it was him, Anyways. and I don't see the use of bothering a stranger about it. Oh, Yero, there are plenty of people here who could help. Like this soldier. Here, you! You look like you could help us. We have the credits. I live to serve. Don't listen to her. We don't need your help. My wife's chasing phantoms, that's all. A friend of hers thought she saw our son on Manit Point, but my wife knows quite well that our son is dead. Our son was taken from us years ago when the Separatists raided our home. My callous husband would rather believe he's dead, but I can't bear the thought. Our friend says she saw him. Oh, I must know if it's true. Where do I come in? Jenna said she saw him at Manit Point. Please. Will you go look for him? I'd give anything to have him back safe. As long as I get paid. Oh, thank you. Thank you. 
His name is Paul, the spitting image of his father. You can't help but recognize him. Well, it's your time, I suppose. Alright, sweet. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video, so thank you for watching. Today. Oh, this guy's just going to interrupt me? Holy. Anyways, thanks for watching, and please be sure to like and favorite this video. If you enjoyed it, you know, you don't have to, but anyways. Also subscribe if you haven't already, that way you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. So, see you next time. Peace.